encountered the Border Princes. Wagner gained a rank. Got some attrition, but that's okay. Yeah, we'll put in the Raiden stance. Could attack, but it's a pretty close fight. They have so many ranged units. I'm actually going to wait till they start taking attrition. Because there's just so many ranged units, there's no way I could take the walls with all that shit raining down upon me. Even with two corpse carts. All die. Alright. Manfred's pretty happy where he is right now. Get another spread public order. Finally, we can start building a reliquary and have enough money left over for the corpse pile to defend it. I really don't know what this one guy is doing. I think he's only raiding to avoid the attrition. But he's still being a dick. Should awaken his battlefield. Should I leave to get a tasty drink? Huh? I'm asking Hadil. What? How, how much should I leave to receive one of those tasty drinks he spoke of the other day? Which tasty drink? Oh. Oh, you mean the uh, hot chocolates? Yes. Just leave like $10. They're like five here but actually let me do the math because they're like 599 uh, multiplied by 1.15 1. like 688 so like seven dollars put 20 on the computer okay For yourself. Okay. Would you like the change? Yes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> what I'll do is I'll pick it up on the way there with my with my monies and then just leave you the change and take the twenty from your computer. Okay. Because it's easier to pick it up on the way. Yes. There's nothing in Averheim right now. And in case Durf doesn't know what we're talking about, there are these really fancy, fun hot chocolates down at our local chocolate store. Yeah. They're flavored hot chocolates, and they come with marshmallows. Okay. But they're like, like gourmet hot chocolates, so... They're a little bit more expensive. Understandable. But they give you so many mini marshmallows, like the, the amount of liquid you're supposed to use in the hot chocolate is not enough to melt all the marshmallows. Aaron Jones, brother. You need, to, you need to let me know what flavor you want. Surprise me. Because there was, there was the candy cane... There was like, I had cookies and cream, and that one was pretty good. It was a white hot chocolate. Uh, I think there was a maple one. I 
I mean, if you want it to be a surprise, I can do that, too. You know how I like surprises. Okay. Build bale fire brazier. No skill point. How oh, many? Let's give you. Let's give you. Lore Master of Vampires. And then we're just waiting for the t to take attrition to death. Still didn't sally forth, which is going to continue to be a problem for them. Oh, next turn I should remember to make a necromancer to actually go do the quest for the unholy sword or whatever. Can the necromancer be Barbara? It's probably going to be due. I don't care. Can they be Barbara? I suppose. Yay. Isabelle's just holding the fort. Pretty much. I actually have a decent stack in Grand Stats. It's not bad, but I didn't want them to keep recruiting, so... And they're still on March, which means they're going to be tired when they do go into battle. So the idea being, by getting both their cities under siege, I lock their entire civilization Oops. down. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'll take the stranger. Projectiles caged bats. Projectiles corpse ball. That's been upgraded. Upgraded. Just 
skill point. Baron von Karnstein. Probably the next thing that you get will be... Curse of Undeath for even more healing. Manfred down here. I want him to go on Fort Jacoba. He can be a Jacoba's witness. <laughs> zombies to suck. He'll have a, one more turn to recruit on his way there. You liked Jacoba's Witness, didn't you? I, I did. That was entertaining. Probably one more spin than I'll have to go, because I do have work. It's a little bit later than normal, but still work. When do you start work again? Ten. Ah. Uh. Everlands being an ass or hand. They're wanting a peace treaty. I know I can see that. I'm watching a stream too. Can you pay me? They'll pay me 1300 I don't know, is that good enough, brother, you think? Like, you're just gonna betray them anyway, right? They will push you off for one turn, and give them one turn of recruiting. Yeah. I want him dead. The thing is, they know that they're, they're fucked, basically. This is what I like to call, uh, checkmate. Well, that's interesting. I think they're gonna fight the Red Horn tribe. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't quite get out of my way, though. <laughs> I think this other army's trying to take Kisla's other province. They want a peace treaty for 300? That's fine. I wonder if they'll give one to me too. No, they just want to stay at war with me. They're a far off place who had no reason to go to war with me anyway, so peace treaty? Yeah, why not? It's basically why I went to war with them. They're a far off place so they won't possibly really do anything with me, so why not go to war with them? And then eventually get offered peace for money? Yeah. That'd be an interesting uh, strategy if someone actually did that. Went to war with every faction that was off continent. Well, I actually did that with um, Minas Tirith uh -huh. in, in the um, Third Age mod. I parked my Isengard army at a really important city that they had to take and then every turn because I was so much more powerful than them I made them pay me 10,000 gold for peace and then on their turn they declare war again ah uh. 
Guess how much money I'm making now? Derf. Yes. You're making seventeen ninety-one. Yep. I have your stream open, you wank. Oh fuck you! Was you gonna allow me to raise a third army, Victor von Karnstein? Karnstein. We've Karnstein. been saying it wrong all along. Fuck you. I said we. I know. So fuck you. I'm trying to see what else I need to work on next. I think I need to start grabbing the um the Laman Book of Blood one. Yeah. I'm almost done the first book. The book first of, book. Book of Arkan, I think. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's not that I'm going to finish out the first book. I'm not sure which yet. Well, I'm finishing the first book because most of my army is skeleton zombie units. Named but Jeff. One side. Yeah, I suppose it does make sense, doesn't it? Once I get advanced buildings, I'll probably do ghouls next, and then animals, and then... See, the thing is that the um, the fourth book is all your economy and support, so it makes sense to do it early, but you can't research more than one thing at a time, so you have to do your armor research. Not taking attrition yet. I just have this feeling they're going to raise an army here if I don't go on it. If they decide to betray me, it would suck for me, but I think they'll be okay for now. I think everyone just wants to suckle on the teeth of Kislev's defeat. If I take Fort Jakova, they stop making all form of money. Um, here's the Golden Order. Sending a dew from Steingart. Look, look, at, look at the dwarves and the orcs leaving so many great battle sites behind for us to raise dead from later when we take over their lands. Remember that, remember that glorious victory over the orcs you had? Remember these warriors? Yeah, yeah right. They're mine now. <laughs> <laughs> Don't want to pay me a thousand in a piece, Trudy. Nope. They're going to run out of treasury soon. After paying all their troops. I can't believe that he got a successful garrison slap, though. It's like, what a petty guy. Right. Keeslip once again decided that they weren't going to have any more shit. Uh, Leonese of the uh, Bretonian Kingdoms, once piece, two hundred showing up. Yeah, they're kind of inconsequential. Oh. 
Yep, let them do their thing. Keep building up Victor over here. Raise some more dead, get him some more dogs. Fell bats. Not a bad little military I'm building up here, huh? That's pretty good. I'm not gonna have him move yet, but I will have him leave Schwarzhofen. The game claims that your military might is slightly better than mine. Yes. Might be. What of it? That's probably entirely in those Vargeists. Yep, she's in here. No, I'm saying she's in here. I can do the quest for the Lieber Noctis next turn. And I can get the Brothers Gorst Corpse Cart mount. So let's do that. So the Gorsk part. Gives. I don't really know what he gives. But he has it now. Oh, they did try and raise an army there. It's worth a lot to sack. I don't like that you tried to raise an army here, sir. <laughs> didn't have a permit. I'm going to loot and occupy because I'm a savage. Man servant. Hilariously puts campaign movement range up. Dark iron pit. Zombie infested iron mine, scoured iron mine. Oh, hero recruit rank plus one for white kings in all provinces. Upkeep minus 30% for graveguard, black knights, and blood knights. Recruitment cost minus 30% for knights recruited in this province, and rank plus two. Let's build that. And then I'll march Manny straight up to Kislev to reinforce this blob, and that should make everyone happy, happy, happy. I think I will upgrade the Abyssal Woods so I can recruit Fargeists and be as strong as Durf. <coughs> apparently that's what we do. Uh, here, let's start building corpse pile. If I wait a turn, I'll be able to afford an ancient armory. Maybe if I get into battle. I'll wait. Keep an eye on the Golden Order to make sure they don't reinforce. Victor can probably scoop up some decent undead from the Battle of uh, 
Schwarzhofen on his way across the border. Alright, gods are angry, yada yada yada. Yeah, I'll tribute one on. Bro, I'm getting kind of tired. That's fine. I was only going to do one more spin at most anyway. We'll just call it here then. Alright. And thank y'all for watching. If you like you saw, definitely check out the uh, much more formal stream tomorrow. We, we'll do some Assassin's Creed tomorrow after uh, I get woke up and get a couple things taken care of. So expect that around maybe 4 or 5 p.m. Um, brother, you work tomorrow? I do. What time? 10 to 6.30. Okay. Ideal. What are you up to tomorrow? Uh, I gotta give Grandma lunch and supper? Yeah. It'll be like 7, 7.30 by the time I get back, probably. Yeah, lunch and supper, and then I'll be home. Alrighty. Well, I'll plan on talking to you guys tomorrow, then. We thank y'all for watching. We will check. We will uh, catch y'all tomorrow. Good night, everybody. Bye.